Hello friends. To message in different languages, we use specific language keyboards on our mobile. On mobile, we can write our messages by scribbling on our mobile touch screen using a handwriting tool. In this video, we will learn in depth about one such handwriting tool. To write message through scribbling, we will install Google Handwriting Input app. To install this, let's go to Google Play Store. Here, let's search Google Handwriting Input app. Let's install the app. Now the app is installed, let's tap on open. To enable and configure this app, let's tap on first step. List of installed keyboards on our mobile will appear. Here let's enable Google handwriting input app. Let's go through the warning message and tap on ok. Now the app is enabled. On my mobile, in the optional menu, only English UK language is listed, which is my system language. If your mobile system language is different, the same will be reflected in the optional menu. If you want to use this handwriting tool for any other language, we have to tap on the box, configure languages. Around 100 different languages are listed here, but they are greyed out and we cannot select them. To make them selectable, let's disable use system languages. Now the language list is selectable. Along with English, I will select and enable Hindi and Kannada. You can enable languages as per your need. Let's go back to Google Handwriting Input Configure page. Now in the optional menu, Hindi and Kannada are also reflected. To download them, let's tap on Download Languages. Languages are downloaded. Now let's tap on third step. Let's try English handwriting tool. We can take a sample trial here. The moment we tap, writing space will pop up. We can scribble our trial message in this space. Our scribbles are converted into words and are displayed just above the writing area along with two suggested words. To know more about this tool in detail, let's try this tool in some messenger. Let's open WhatsApp. As per my experience, for English typing, swipe is better. However, for other language, where swipe is not available, this handwriting tool is a better option than keying in through a keyboard. To check the list of all installed keyboards, let's long press on spacebar. The list will open. If you want, we can select the desired keyboard from here. I will select Hindi handwriting. I will try this tool for Hindi. As soon as we complete the word and lift our finger from the touch screen, the word will appear in the message box on the top and will move leftwards and disappear from the writing area. There is an undo symbol which is left to the globe symbol at the bottom of the writing area. If we tap on this symbol, the last written word will appear again in the writing area and we can edit it. If we want, we can add to the word. Or we can delete last strokes by tapping on undo symbol again and again. Whenever we scribble any word, the word in text will appear in the center, just above the writing area. Two more words close to the same word will appear on both sides. By default, the center word is selected. But if we want, we can select any one of them and the same will appear in the message box. To jump to next line in the message box, we should tap on the enter key. After a specific amount of time of lifting our fingers from the writing area, this tool will conclude that our word is complete and the word will appear in the message box and disappear from the writing area in order to provide space for the next word. This specific time can be increased or decreased as per our requirement. For this adjustment, let's long tap on globe symbol and go to settings. Here by default, the set time is 400 milliseconds or say 0.4 seconds. This set time can be changed. 
Let's reduce this time to minimum and try. The words are moving to left before we can finish it. As during scribbling, we have to lift our finger. Therefore, the set time is very less and not correct. Now let's go back to settings and increase the set time to 550 milliseconds. In my opinion, we should keep it somewhere around 500 milliseconds. You can try and then set as per your scribbling speed. It's better to keep it slightly more so that we don't have to hit undo again and again. In case sometime if we find this time to be higher, we can always tap spacebar to indicate the tool that our word is completed the way we do it in regular typing. There are some more settings for this handwriting tool. One such setting is its theme. Let's select and try dark theme. This theme looks attractive. We can always insert emojis in the messages. There is one more setting called cloud button. Let's enable this and try. Now a cloud symbol has appeared here. If we enable this, the word samples written by us will be uploaded to Google server to recognize, analyze and improve their recognition technology so that they can provide better options in future. Though Google claims that they maintain our privacy, still if we have doubt, we can always disable this cloud option to secure our privacy. By tapping gently on the globe symbol, we can change the install keyboards in sequence. If we don't tap gently, it will take us to settings. But no worry, we can always come back. Let's change back to English handwriting. If we scribble in capital letters, the tool will convert it to capital letters only. This tool has a drawback that it will not be able to differentiate between 0 and O, 1 and I. So it provides both numerical and alphabetical options to choose from. Whenever 0 and 1 are used along with other numbers, the tool will recognize them as numbers. We can select and download any language available on this tool and handwrite messages in that particular language. To write messages in handwriting, it's not necessary that we can scribble only by this tool. If we have installed Gboard on our mobile, we can enable handwriting keyboard in Gboard and scribble. Let me uninstall this handwriting app. Let's go back to WhatsApp. Let's long tap on spacebar and go to languages and settings. Let's tap on English. Here different keyboards for English are available. We can select English handwriting keyboard if we want to scribble in English. Now let's enable handwriting keyboard for Kannada and Hindi in Gboard and try. Gboard is also from Google and both handwriting keyboards are quite similar which is very obvious. Google handwriting tool is a dedicated handwriting keyboard and can be used without installing Gboard. To write messages in languages other than English, I prefer this handwriting tool since it is really very easy and fast compared to keying in. But for messaging in English, I still prefer swipe as I feel more comfortable with swipe. I hope you must have liked this tool and will give it a try. Please write your feedback in the comment box. Enjoy easy and fast messaging using this tool. Let's conclude this video here. If you found this video useful, please hit the thumbs up icon. Please also share this video in your social circle. It will encourage us to upload more videos. If you have not yet subscribed our channel, please do subscribe our channel A1 Help. Please also click on bell icon to get notifications of our forthcoming videos. For any query or suggestion, please leave a message in the comment box. Let's meet again in next video. Thanks for watching till end. Bye.